Justin David Hawkins, born 17 March 1975, is an English musician and singer-songwriter, best known for being the lead singer and lead guitarist of The Darkness. Heavily influenced by classic bands of the 1970s and 1980s, particularly Queen, Aerosmith, The Flippard, and DC slash DC, Hawkins is noted for his falsetto singing voice and on-stage persona. He was also the lead singer and guitarist for the band Hot Leg, formed in 2008, and now on hiatus. Since 2005 he has been active in his synth-pop alter ego British Whale. Music Career The Darkness Hawkins began playing clubs and pubs with The Darkness until they were signed by record label Atlantic Records. Their debut album, Permission to End, went straight to number 2 in the UK charts upon its release on 7 July 2003, before going to number 1 and staying there for 4 weeks, eventually going on to sell 1.5 million copies in the UK. 3.5 M copies overall. The Darkness took inspiration for some of their work from the local North Suffolk area, including Black Shock, which mentions the nearby village of Lipburg. The success of this album led to heavy touring for the band, including European portions of Metallica's Summer Sanitarium Tour 2003. They then went on to headline the Curling Festival in 2004. The band won three great awards in 2004 in response to the album, Best Group, Best Rock Group, and Best Album. They also won two Caring Awards in 2004 for Best Live Act and Best British Band. The third single from the album, I Believe in a Thing Called Love, was a substantial hit in the UK as was their tilt at the Christmas 2003 number one. Christmas Time, Don't Let the Bells End, which only just fell short, both singles reaching no luck to in 2003. The band also appeared in the video, Ben 820, with Justin singing a number of lines. By late 2004 the band's constant media coverage had started to lead to general public backlash, and Hawkins and the band themselves seemed to show signs that they were disillusioned with their constant media appearances, infamously walking off of an episode of the US nationally syndicated radio talk show Loveline on 19 April 2004. In October 2005, a month before the album One Way Ticket to Hell, and Beck was to be officially released, Hawkins won an eBay auction for a copy of One Way Ticket to Hell, and back for £350 under the username, TurboGunHawk. He claimed he did this so that he could track down whoever sold the digitally marked advanced copy of the album, and tried to prevent it from happening again. One Way Ticket, the first single from their second album, was released on 14 November 2005, debuting and peaking at number 8 on the UK singles chart. The album itself was released on 28 November 2005, to somewhat mixed reviews. The album was produced by rock producer Roy Thomas Baker, best known for his work with Queen. Early sales figures in the UK showed the album had not sold as well its predecessor, Permission to End. The album debuted at No. 11, and fell to number 34 in the second week of its release. Although it went on to achieve platinum status, this was in stark contrast with their debut's five times platinum status. The second single taken from their second album was Is It Just Me? Released on 20 February 2006. The single gained a preliminary position of no. 6 all that week, but finally charted at number 8. Hawkins announced when on stage that their third single to be released from the album was, Girlfriend. Released 22 May, Girlfriend, charted at number 39. The band followed up their second album with a tour of the UK and Ireland, consisting of 12 dates in the major cities. The tour opened in Dublin's Point Depot on 4 February, and closed in the Nottingham Arena on 20 February. Few of the venues sold out, their appeal seemingly having become more selective. Their world tour, which followed, arrived in Australia and Japan after touring Scandinavia and continental Europe in March. In October 2006, Hawkins left the darkness. Although drug and alcohol problems were initially cited as the main reason, later on national television, Hawkins would claim that he had grown tired of the constant routine of the band, recording and promoting an album, going on tours for months, back in the studio, etc. which he considered monotonous and boring and could not understand how bands like the Rolling Stones could sustain it. For his time with the darkness, Hawkins placed at number 35 on Spin's list of the greatest frontmen of all time. In 2011 the band reunited and toured Europe, Asia and North America throughout 2011 and 2012 in support of their new album of Hot Cakes. Other projects In 2005, Hawkins set up a solo project, called British Whale. His debut single, This Town Ain't Big Enough For Both Of Us, a cover of the 1974 hit by Sparks, was released on 15 August, reached No. 6 on the UK singles chart, and featured multiple world arts champion Phil Taylor in the video. In 2006 Hawkins released a second single, available only to download, an unofficial World Cup anthem called England. 
Hawkins sang backing vocals on Sweet's song, Hellraiser, for Def Leppard's 2006 covers album Yeah! Exclamation. In early 2007, he became a half of one of six acts competing to represent the UK in the Eurovision Song Contest competition in Helsinki in a duet with singer Beverly Brown. He entered making your mind up with Beverly Brown singing a song entitled, They Don't Make Them Like They Used To, but did not win the competition. On 16 March 2007, he appeared on the comic relief evening during the half-hour top gear of the Pops program. This saw him performing Billy Ocean's Red Light Smells Danger with the three top gear presenters. Later that month, on 29 March, Hawkins created a new MySpace profile featuring songs that were planned to be included on his upcoming solo album entitled Panther. The songs are titled, You Can't Hurt Me Anymore, I've Met Jesus, and Whichever. On 12 May, Hawkins added a further song to his profile, Pain Ladies, to appear on the same album. Later, on 13 July, he removed all the songs, and mentioned, You Just Have To Wait. Clarification needed, he later announced a new band lineup, and name, Hot Leg. The aforementioned songs featured on the Hot Leg album Red Light Fever. Hawkins also announced that he had been participating in the recording of two Magnet Watch albums entitled Nude Horizon and Party Party Time Time. On 8 November 2007, at 3.00 m, Hawkins posted a MySpace blog containing directions to do the green thing, an organization for which he has composed a new song, Do It In The Dark, to accompany a short film that encourages people to switch off and save energy. The song has not been released as a single, but is available as a free download. There is a wax model of Hawkins at Madame Tussauds in London. Hawkins supplied the singing and guitar playing for Kurtz, the lead singer of the Bad Guy Band, meant in the BBC animated series Free Phoenix, which debuted on 4 January 2008. In the film Tailstar, a film about Joe Meek's life and career that was released on 19 June 2009, he played the role of Screaming Lord Sudge. With Hot Leg in November 2008, he toured the UK supporting Alter Bridge for 13 November and Extreme 14-24 November. Hawkins has also worked with British pop rock band Saving Amy, having recently completed producing their debut album. He also lent his Truth Larynx to the track Party All Day, Fuck All Night, guesting on the 2009 Steel Panther release, Feel the Steel. Hawkins recently worked with Adam Lambert on the track Music Again of his debut album. Justin played the role of Josh, a burned out rock star in the movie Psychosis, 2010. The movie also featured three hot leg songs. Hawkins also appeared on the Meatloaf album of Hang Cool Teddy Bear, where he co-wrote two songs, Love Is Not Real, and California Isn't Big Enough. He also provided guitar on, California Isn't Big Enough, and backing vocals on, Love Is Not Real, and, Los Angeles Are. In 2012, Hawkins appeared in a Samsung commercial for their Galaxy Note smartphone during Super Bowl Roman 46. In 2016, Hawkins appeared on the De La Soul album, and the anonymous Nobody, providing vocals on the track Lord Intended. Personal Life Justin, although born in Surrey, is from Lowestoft. In August 2006 it was reported, and later confirmed by the darkness management, that Hawkins had been admitted to the Priory, a rehabilitation clinic. On 11 October 2006 Hawkins revealed spending £150,000 in three years on cocaine after entering the charts in 2003 with their single, I Believe in a Thing Called Love. Justin lives in Switzerland when not on tour with the band. Voice Hawkins is well known for his use of falsetto in his singing style. His vocal range spans from 8 to 25. Citation needed. Equipment. Hawkins is seen playing Gibson Les Paul customs almost exclusively. He is most commonly seen playing an alpine white model, which he used with the darkness, as seen in the I Believe in a Thing Called Love and Love is Only a Feeling music videos, and with Hot Leg. It is rare to see him use another guitar, although he can be seen playing a custom Ibanez gem for the song, Bald. He has also been seen using an Ebony Gibson Les Paul custom, a one-off Gibson Les Paul custom sculpted to resemble a shell, and a custom finished blue Les Paul stinger there brushed with the mythical dot black shock and lit church. In 2004 Gibson issued a limited run of Justin Hawkins' signature Les Paul customs based on the 68 R.I. with a ballon and mother of pearl flame inlays on the fretboard, a sparkle finish in either silver burst or pink burst, although a blue burst and red burst has been picked as well as a one-off gold mirror finish done by CMS Custom Guitars. These have become highly valuable because of their scarcity and unique features. On 8 January 2005 Justin donated his custom Gibson Redburst guitar to the Sun's Great Tsunami Earthquake Appeal Online Auction. It is also notable that Hawkins made use of Mesa Boogie Doo and Triple Rectifier amplifiers rather than much amplification when performing with the darkness. The stacks he was using had custom-made speaker cabs coated in red leather. 
During his time in Hot Leg, he was exclusively seen using Cornford MK50 drone, choosing white vinyl with two Cornford, 16 ohm, 4x12 cabinets loaded with Celestion, vintage 30s. Since the Darkness Reformation, he has been seen using multiple modified Marshall 1959 MK Flex series shoe guitar amps with a boosted gain stage run through Marshall 1960B cabinets. Since 2016, Hawkins uses EVH and Wizard amplifiers. As for pedals, in a 2012 edition of Guitarist Magazine's video series, On the Road With, Justin's pedal setup consisted of a bass analog delay, a Procorat, a Diamond Pedals Compressor, a Boss TU-3 tuner, and a Dunlop Crybaby DCR to SRAC module, which allows him to have three separate wah-wah pedals strategically placed around the stage. As of 2016, Hawkins doesn't use any pedals. On the song Girlfriend, Hawkins uses a Moog Keter for the solo.